Hey everybody, good morning. Happy Monday, friends. Lois with Ellie Grace's Attic here to share with you a little Monday morning motivation out of my little devotion book, Life is Better at the Beach. Um, this morning, we're out on the back deck. It's where I usually try to come to you from. Um, although, as it's getting cooler and more into fall, it's a little bit later because I have to wait for it to come up so you can see me. <laughs> Um, but I just love being on the back deck. The hummingbirds in and out this morning. Uh, the cats around. You might hear our, we have an outside cat. So he's, he's uh, hovering around looking for some breakfast this morning. But we're going to uh, go ahead and get started. This morning is talking about, or this chapter is talking about waves. So it says, how many times have you stood up against a wave only to get a torrent of water up your nose? It's inevitable and uncomfortable, too. Nobody likes water up their nose. Finding the water won't get you very far, but once you let your body drift along with the waves, you will have success and a dry nose. God's plan for you may not be what you envisioned. Um, it, is, it, is it ever what we envision? <laughs> I don't know about you, but I'm like a planner and an administrator and so I usually have things mapped out and I'm usually the person that's telling God okay God I want you to answer my prayer here's your options on how to answer and uh, that's not how God does it <laughs> um, so God's plan for you may not be what you envisioned it probably has twists and turns that you didn't expect or even want but you will find one thing to be true. It's better to yield to the waves than to stand resolutely trying to hold your ground. You are in safe hands of the Heavenly Father, the one whose voice spoke the very water into existence and calms the seas has a specific plan for you and for me. It's a good plan. He is a good, good Father. It's a good plan and it's a perfect plan. Rest in that truth today, and the next time a wave appears, sink into its swell and ride it. So I hope that just encourages your heart today to know that even though God's plan, I mean, it's okay to question God, right? I know there have been times when I've been like, okay, Lord, what the heck are you doing? Like, this does not, this is not where I thought I'd be. This is not what I thought this would look like. This, I do not see the end, but we just have to trust that the Lord's got us, that he is working this out. Um, and when we can't, um, we can't see his hand or where it's going, we can always trust his heart. Um, and I promise that you know, when you're fighting the Lord, I'm saying this from personal experience, when you're fighting against what he has for you and you're zigzagging all over here when he wants you to go here, you are just going to be so miserable. But when you are in his will and his perfect plan for your life, you are just going to have peace. You're going to have that peace beyond understanding that only he can give you. You're going to have blessings. Um... You're going to have joy. It's not to say that it's not going to be hard. In fact, I can almost guarantee you it's going to be hard at times. But he's going to be with you always. And um, you're going to have that joy that cannot be moved. And so he'll see you through that. So sink into the wave and ride it today. And uh, know that he's working all things for your good. So anyway, I love you guys. I hope this encourages your heart today. Um, have a great Monday. I'll see you guys again with something crafty, maybe a little bit later today. Um, uh oh, the cat just jumped up here. Um, if not for sure, I'll see you next Monday for some more motivation. Have a great day.